Hi friends, welcome back to The Classy Mommy. I'm Brittany and I'm glad you're here. In this week's Outfits of the Week, I am definitely feeling spring, even though we're not quite into spring yet. I found this adorable dress at um, Fred Meyer over the weekend, so I think they just pulled this out. It's an A-line button down, and it kind of has this little bit of um, pleating here on the top. It um, has a slip lining, which um, I think I'll probably end up trying to find a different slip that lays just a little bit smoother um, for underneath later, but it's not bad. It is removable. Uh, it works, but I think I'll try to find something different later. All right, um, I like the buttons because it, I feel like I can wear this um, later on when I do have more babies. I feel like it gives just some flexibility in that postpartum nursing season. And I love the little tie belt. It's just a little um, detachable fabric tie belt. It has a collar, which I love. Um, it is sleeveless. In my school, in my community, I would feel comfortable going sleeveless because it is a full sleeve, just um, ends right here at the end of my shoulder but it's still a little too chilly for that. So maybe I'll wear this again um, later towards the end of the school year and I'll be able to take my jacket off through the day. I have um, just this necklace you've seen a bunch um, this week. I feel like it's just really bringing out um, a lot of my spring, complementing my spring colors and I love it. This, um, this uh, dress kind of has a, a mid-tone gray with the yellow and some white, but I, I love blue and yellow together. To me, that's just so springy, summery. Um, again, this crop jacket, you saw this the end of last week, and I really like um, the crop length because I feel like on me, <clears throat> I don't know if you can see, but right here is the small part of my waist, and so it just sort of cinches in and I think brings your eye to where the small part is. And I think I mentioned this in my uh, last week's video, if you saw it, I do have some um, other, quite a few other denim jackets that are full length, so, so that would be about here on me. And I feel like when I wear dresses, I want the, um, the waistline brought up just a little bit because that's typically where the dress is coming in. And I, I think it's just a really flattering to kind of have the jacket in there as well. When I um, tried on some of my spring dresses with my full length denim jackets, I felt like I felt a little swallowed, especially with the flowiness down here in the A-line. I've got a couple dresses with this similar shape. <clears throat> so anyways, um, I will also um, be cupping up my sleeves in a couple minutes, just simple diamond studs and that's it for today. Oh, on my feet, I do have um, these nude colored um, belly flats. I got them on Amazon. They're from Nine West. I am definitely looking for some patent leather um, nude belly, belly flats. So if you have any that are your favorites, please let me know down below. Did I get everything? Oh, jacket was um, thrifted from quite a few years ago. Let's see, where is it originally from? Oh, American Eagle. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Even this morning, it is rainy, it's a little chilly, um, but you can tell spring is quickly approaching. And I got so many compliments even just walking into work and dropping off my kids at preschool. Um, because of the colors I'm wearing, <clears throat> I feel I feel like it's very different than all the blacks and dark grays and navies um, that we've been seeing a lot of and are still seeing a lot of because it's not officially spring yet. I'm just pretending it's spring, um, but I feel like I'm, I'm bringing in spring colors in a way that's still weather appropriate that's just making me feel a little bit lighter and brighter. All right, I've got this jean jacket on. You've seen this a million times. This is from um, Target quite a few years ago. I did get this scarf recently from Loft. It just came out at Loft, so I know it'll still be there <clears throat> when I'm shooting this in um, early March. And this dress underneath, you saw this last fall. It's from Garnet Hall, Garnet Hill. It's called like their Jersey um, swing dress, I believe. And I kind of like the seaming. Um, it just kind of flows. I, I think it would be good for um, like a maternity and postpartum, but I'm neither of those things right now. Um, these leggings, or I'm sorry, tights you've seen before, and I know Nikki Moreno really loves these um, <clears throat> from Inspired by Nikki. I just got these at Target based on her recommendation, and I really do enjoy them, especially as I'm trying to pretend it's spring and want to wear spring colors, but it's still chilly in the mornings here in Idaho. So that's really nice. They're not um, fleece lined, but they are called like a sweater knit type. And then I've got these um, tall boots on from Clark's that I've had for four or five years. <clears throat> so I do feel like I'm warm, but I like the lighter layers, the lighter tights that still keep my legs warm and covered. And last, you know what, last week I didn't have to wear um, tights in the morning. It was just daylight savings time, so I feel like we're a little chillier in the mornings than we have been um, because of the time change. But I really love um, this color for spring and early fall. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, welcome back. 
All right, I am just feeling so springy and I'm loving all these colors. I know I wore this jacket quite a bit um, last fall and even through the winter. I don't know that I'll continue wearing it when it gets super, super um, warm outside. It is not lined. It's from White House Black Market, <clears throat> but I love that it's not lined because as a teacher, I'm frequently like overhead, stretching, reaching, and I don't want anything that's restricting. So it's super stretchy. It feels just like a jean jacket because it's kind of a canvasy denim material, um, but it has a little bit of like the bling bling and fancy little, um, I guess they're not sparkly, but just sort of like detailed buttons. I love the cut of it. I have two jackets in this cut from White House Black Market. The other one is a coated burgundy, like leather wet look kind of <clears throat> jacket. Um, this one is a denim and I just love um, kind of the shape, how it goes up on the sides and then comes down in the front and it's slightly cropped. Of course, my torso is very long. I think on a regular person with a regular length torso, it would just be like a standard typical length, but I really love it. I just feel like when I put it on, I feel like I have, you know, my curves and shape and it's just really flattering. So that's my jacket, but I might take it off through the day. I have this shawl on also from my house black market. It's two or three years old. I got it um, in between babies. I really liked wearing it postpartum as well because it's kind of, um, I'll take my jacket off so you can see it. All right, now you can see it better. So I got it between babies because it's kind of a little flowy and just skimmed over like the stomach area, which was so nice. And the pattern was really nice for, you know, baby messes and spit ups and stuff. And the, the back is just a little bit longer. So I, I don't think I'd wear this with leggings cause it's not, you know, I feel like here is a length that I'm comfortable with for leggings in the front. Um, the back is long enough for leggings. Sorry, there it is. Um, but the front is not for me. Um, it's double lined, so I don't have to wear a camisole underneath, but it does go a little bit low, so I do. Um, I also love the little detailing on the sleeves, the little lace, I think it's just so feminine, and little ruffles around here. I haven't seen this top um, on eBay or Poshmark. Um, <clears throat> sometimes they do come up. Um, these pants I just got, these are thrifted, and I got them um, you know, just from my local thrift store. They're from Joe Fresh, and I'm really enjoying them. And then of course you've seen my Veragamo, uh, sorry, Ferragamo Vera Bow Pumps in the nude patent leather. And I'm loving wearing these. I did keep these out year round. We didn't have a very um, intense winter this year. Not a lot of precipitation. Last year, um, we had a ton more. I wouldn't have worn them in the winter um, the, just because they're open and my toes would have been cold. But I was able to kind of use them year round here. So especially now that we're early, early spring, technically late winter, and I'm pulling out my springy stuff, I feel like they're just perfect. And here they are. So comfortable and just the perfect heel height. All right, uh, simple hair just pulled back, um, some heirloom family earrings, my wedding ring, and of course, my springy fingernail polish color. I mean, it doesn't really like entirely coordinate or match, but I don't care. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys next time. Hi friends. All right, today's outfit is so comfortable. Um, you've seen these shoes before. Um, they're just my Nine West flat ones. I am looking for new leather probably patent leather um, ballet flat. So if you have any suggestions, please tell me down below. Um, I got this dress a year ago on eBay. It was pre-owned, but it's originally from Garnet Hill and they had this dress for a really long time. It was called the Starlet Dress and I do see some still on like Poshmark and eBay. Um, however, they no longer make this style. I love this style. I think I currently have three or four of them maybe just three still, um, but I've had a bunch in the past, just different colors and prints, because they're so comfortable. Um, I had them in a smaller size before I had babies, so um, some of them don't fit anymore. They go just to the knee, which I feel like is such a nice length to still be modest and appropriate. I never worry when I go to sit down or stand up or get in and out of my car in this dress, and I do wear these all summer long, but um, I really like this um, print for early spring as well. So it's like this gray faux snake print. It's an empire waist. So it comes right here, which is super flattering and it has pockets. And it's super flattering for like early pregnancy and postpartum because it is really stretchy and this is a crossover top. So it would be really great for um, like a nursing friendly or like early stages of pregnancy dress. I just have my camisole underneath and this uh, denim jacket is from Target uh, about three years ago and I just cuffed the hems. 
I have my teacher watch on and just um, little simple pearls, my wedding ring, and I changed up my fingernails to be a little bit more vibrant and springy because the sun has just been coming out and it's been glorious. So this is my very comfortable, very relaxed, but still polished outfit of the day. I'll see you tomorrow. Hi friends, welcome back. As you can tell, it's a wacky hair day at school. Um, that's about as wacky as I get. I put in this bow. My husband's from Minnesota, so it's like a Minnesota Viking colored, you know, hair thing. It's not my school colors, but it's pretty wacky. At least my students in the hallway so far are telling me that it's like really crazy and wacky, you know. Um, so that's my with why I've got this going on. But I wanted to show you my outerwear because I haven't shown you for spring yet. Um, this trench coat was, um, I got it on eBay, it was pre-owned. It's originally from White House Black Market, but it's just a standard khaki color trench. Um, on my feet, I'm wearing these thrifted Clark's booties that are kind of um, rustic. I really enjoy these in the fall and in the spring because I feel like brown is just a really great transitional color. So I changed up from my black handbags to my brown as well um, for my handbag. This one I did get pre-owned. It's vintage from Coach. It's, um, I believe it's called their court bag and it's got this little top handle. I think this is sort of a, <clears throat> a vintage original version of a Louboutin one. That, the, um, I think it's called the can't remember. Anyways, if you know what it's called, you can let me know down in the comments down below. But there's a Louboutin one that's similar, and I actually saw a bunch of um, comparison videos between the two, and I really liked this one better in the end, and it's just, you know, obviously a fraction of the cost. So I've been loving this um, brown cognac color. Uh, my scarf, I will probably wear through the day and take off if I get too warm. It's new. It's from Loft. It just came out like this last week, so now I'll show you my outfit underneath. All right, friends, this is my springy outfit for today. Underneath, I have this jersey. It's a V-neck um, jersey dress from Eileen Fisher. And I did get this from Garnet Hill's website last, the end of last summer. And I feel like it was because the color was um, dated. It was, I think it was called Ash. It's just a really nice medium charcoal gray. Uh, I feel like that this color was associated with the past season, so they were like clearancing out this dress, but they still have the same dress just in the new season's colors, and I see it online all over the place. Um, so I got it just for a, just a killer deal. I did size up. Um, all the sizing charts said uh, a small would be perfect, but I chose the medium because I ordered the small, and I felt like it was just like super short, and I wasn't comfortable um, having like bare legs with something that short. And I knew that I wanted to be able to wear this kind of dress um, in transition seasons and winter. On top, I have um, this army green vest I got last year from White House Black Market, so it's not current. But I really like the uh, the gold details and, and there's like a gold rim around the tortoiseshell buttons, which I think is just a really fun little luxe glam detail. And then of course this um, scarf I just got from Loft. I really liked it because I love wearing shades of green and um, coral because um, I'm a light spring seasonal um, coloring. That's my seasonal coloring. Um, so I really like that it kind of blends a lot of the colors that I like to wear this time of year. And it's super lightweight and almost like kind of breezy. So it will be really nice even through the summer like on chilly nights or if we go down to a lake or things like that. Sorry friends, I cut off pretty quick because I had some um, students coming in to help with some things. So I just uh, cut it off there. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great week. I hope you found some inspiration and I would love it if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. I'll see you next time.